Well, there are some fancy drum sounds as well, as you can see here. And we'll try one. For example, this one here. Sounds quite good. Because what we're going to do right now is we're trying to build up our bass line. Drum, heavy kick, and run. Well, that's just the result <laughs> that we get when we hit the play button down here. And, uh, well, we can use the sample command quite like the play command. So it produces a sound, it starts producing the sound, and um, we need to sleep if we want to have a notable pause for until the next uh, sound. And, as you know already, this will act quite similar to the play command. If this sample was very long, for example, then uh, even a sleep one might not be enough. It's, uh, if this is a two-beat uh, sample, uh, this sample here, after a sleep one, will still overlap, overlap by one beat with the next sound that is going to be produced. And we choose another one here. Let's see. Uh, there are snare drums, SN, snare drums, a generic snare drum. That's what we're going to use. So let's see how this sounds. Okay. Bang. Okay. So that was a very short sequence, kind of a piece of rhythm. Now, we're going to use more samples now. So let's say now we're going to sleep 1.5 beats and uh, we use another sample or the same sample over again. Th that would be the drum heavy kick. And we sleep now in order to make it match a little bit. So we sleep only half a beat right now and sample again the snare drum generic. Let's see how this sounds. Okay, apart from being quite slow still, this is okay. And of course I can hit run over and over again. Let's see if I can manage it. Well, more or less. Too late. <laughs> well, as you can see, it's quite difficult to hit it exactly in the hit run exactly in the right moment. So we need to find a solution for that as well. 